Hey everybody, it's Mr. Montgomery again, and we're going to review some Wilson letters and letter sounds. So I have my sound cards right here, my little drill sound cards. Okay, so we're going to do just four letters today. So we're going to review, first, we're going to review the letter M. Okay, so first we're going to say the letter, then the picture, and then the sound. So I like to tap three different times, okay? So M, man, M. And after I finish a card, you're going to echo. And when we say echo, we mean repeat. All right, so let's try it. M, man, M. Try it one time. M, man, M. All right. Go to our next letter, which is N. N, nut, n. Did you wait? Did you did you say? Mm, let's try it one more time. Ready? N, nut, n. All right. Our next letter is O. O, octopus, ah. Your turn. Can I hear it one more time? One more time? Ah, much better. And our last letter is P, P, pan, p. I just, you should feel the air coming out of your mouth when you go p, p. So go ahead, hold your hand up. Feel that, that breath coming out? That's the sound P. P, pan, P. Your turn. All right. Now, what we're going to do is if uh, you have a communicator, so maybe you're in my classroom and you have one of these fancy communicators, go ahead and get it, and a dry erase marker. Or if you have like a little whiteboard and a dry erase marker, you can use that too. Or, if you don't have any of this, that's fine. You can get a pencil and paper, or you can be a little fun and creative and get a pen or a paper and crayon. That works too. Anything at all you can write with, okay? All right, so let's get those, and we're going to start practice writing our letters to make sure that we're writing them the correct way. All right? All right, everyone, we're going to start with our letter M. So going to start at the <clears throat> excuse me going to start at the grass line right here and then we're just going to go straight up stop at the skyline then go down and over to the plane line back up and over to the skyline again and down to the grass line and sorry it's a little curve there I'm trying to round this little doodle pad I have and it's not the easiest all right, so let's do it one more time. So remember, we're going to be starting at the grass line, where that dot is. And we're going to go straight up to the skyline, down and over to the plane line, then up and over to the skyline again, then all the way down to the grass line. Now, it's okay if your M's don't look perfect. Mine sure don't. But as we practice, they are going to look better and better. So go ahead and practice writing the capital letter M all the way down this line, wherever you're writing it. So you're going to keep writing all the way down and put, a, I call it a nice finger space in between each letter. So you can actually put your finger down between each letter M and make sure that there is a little bit of a gap. So go ahead and fill up the line. All right, if you're all done, we're going to move on to the lowercase m. If you need more time, that's fine. Hit the space bar on your keyboard, that long blank rectangle, and I'll pause the video. 
If, and then when you're all done, you can just hit the spacebar again and it will continue for you. Okay, so for our lowercase m, I'm going to start at the plane line here. Go and go down to the grass line and then bounce back up and over once we hit that plane line down and then bounce back up and over that plane line and down to the grass line. All right. So the middle of this, it's not going to touch all the way at the bottom. It's not going to touch that grass line. It's going to stop about halfway. Let's try it again. So start at the plane line, go down to the grass line, bounce up and over, then halfway, bounce up and over again, and down to the grass line. And again, it's okay if it doesn't look perfect. And the more you practice, the better it's going to look, and the faster you're going to make your lowercase m's. So down. Now, ooh, not the best, but it's really hard writing on doodle pad. Let's try it again. Bounce up and over, stop, up and over, stop. And you're going to start and end at the grass line. So go ahead and keep on writing your lowercase m's all the way across that line. Okay, if you need more time, go ahead and hit that space bar to pause the video, and then whenever you're done, hit the space bar again. But for my friends that are all set and ready to go, we're going to move on to our next letter, which is the letter N. So for our capital letter N, we're going to start at the grass line again, just like the letter M. Go start the grass line. And you're just going to go straight up to the skyline. And then we're going to go down and over. All, back down to that grass line again. And then we're going to go straight up to the skyline. Okay, that's our capital letter N. Now start at that grass line. Go all the way up. Over and down to the grass line. And then straight up. Okay, now go ahead and continue writing that letter N all the way across that line. Make sure you use finger spaces between each and every letter. All right, if you need more time, hit that space bar just like we're practicing. And when you're all set, hit the space bar again. For my friends that are ready to go on, a lowercase n is just like a, it's like a half of a lowercase m. Watch, if you start at that skyline, go down, bounce back up and over at that skyline, back down to the grass line. See, it's like half of the lowercase m, but it's our n. All right, let's try again. Start that skyline. I'm sorry, plane line. Go down to grass line, bounce up and over the plane line and down to the grass line. All right. So go ahead and finish filling up this whole line with lowercase m's all the way across. Okay, for my friends who are all done, we're going to continue, but if you need more time, that's fine as always. Just hit that space bar, pause the video, and whenever you're ready, hit the space bar again to continue. Okay, now is probably one of the easiest letters that we're going to have, the letter O. So I'll just start that skyline, and we just make a big circle. 
we go down and around and then kind of hit that grass line a little bit and come back up Ooh, not the best looking over but that's okay we're gonna do it again start that, that skyline up there right where we made that dot down around and back up all right and that's all it is you're just making a big circle that goes from the skyline to the grass line and it ends right where it starts so go ahead and fill up that whole line with capital letter O's all right and let's go on to our lowercase o so it's the same exact thing, except instead of starting way up here at that skyline, we're going to start at the plane line. And so we start at that plane line, right where I made that dot. And we're just going to go around and down to the grass line and back up. And that's it. That's it. Our lowercase o. Probably the easiest, most fun letter there is. So start at the plane line, around and down, and back up, and you end where you start. Right, and go ahead and fill up that whole row with lowercase o's. Okay, and if you're still working, hit that space bar. If not, we're going to move on to our last letter for today. So now we're going to move on to our uppercase P. So we're going to start right here at that skyline, right where we made that little red dot. And we're just going to go straight down to the grass line. And then we're going to lift up our pencil, go back up to where we put that dot, and around and down, it's going to curve in at that plane line. Okay, so we're going to start that skyline, go straight down, lift up, go back to that dot, and around and down to the plane line. Okay, so let's do that again. Put a nice little space in between, a finger space, skyline, to grass line, lift up your pencil, back to that point that we made at the skyline around and down to the plane line okay and go ahead and continue practicing that letter P the capital P all the way across your line and keep good finger spaces between each letter <clears throat> All right, and let's go into our lowercase p. So instead of starting at the skyline, we start at the plane line. Okay, and it's kind of like a capital P, just kind of drop down. So we're going to start that plane line, go down to the worm line, stop, pick up your pencil, back to that dot that we made, and around and down to the grass line. So it's like the same thing, except it just dropped down to the worm line. That's all. So let's try it again. We're going to make a little starting dot at the plane line. Go straight down to the worm line. Pick up our pencil. Back to the plane line, and we go around and down to the grass line. All right, so go ahead and keep practicing your lowercase p all the way across that line and keep nice finger spaces in between each letter. Okay, and 
that's all for the letters that we're going to practice today, guys. So we practiced the letters M, N, O, and P, uh, the capitals and lowercase, and we also practiced our letter sounds. So make sure you keep practicing, write every single chance you get, and I promise you will get very, very good at writing. Okay, so I hope to see you all again next time, and I'll see you later. Have a great day.